Leading off at six, a local gymnast and alternate on the United States women's gymnastics team has tested positive for COVID-19. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brad Stevens. Carolyn has the night off. KCTV 5's Neil Jones has been on top of this story all day and joins us now live. Neil. Brad, it really is heartbreaking to see a young lady pursue her dream of making it to the Olympic Games only to have it dashed because of a positive COVID test. We are inside the gymnasium, Gage Gymnastics Center here in Blue Springs, and these are the faces of the young ladies and young men who want to follow. They've already turned out six Olympians over the years from this gym. They want to follow in their footsteps. Kara Aker had made that trip, but her Olympic dream came to a crashing halt today. Her parents got the news late last night. We got a phone call saying that she tested positive again, and then they did a secondary test after that, and it was also positive. The 18-year-old Grain Valley High School grad was immediately put in quarantine, but she was allowed to phone her mom and dad. She has no symptoms, and uh, she feels good, uh, she said. She's a little bored. They've quarantined her now and separated her from everyone else. That's tough, especially considering how excited Kara was about enjoying her Olympic experience, something we talked about two weeks ago. I was really looking forward to just seeing the different culture and like all the buildings and like just seeing what Tokyo was like. Kara's Gage gymnastics teammate, Leanne Wong, has not been vaccinated, but as of this morning, she passed all of her COVID tests. On Friday, I asked her dad, Dr. Marco Wong, if he was concerned about having his daughter in a COVID hotspot. No, I'm not um, worried. I think uh, there's a lot of uh, precautions, testing, retesting, social distancing, people wearing masks. But Kara's dad can't help but worry about his daughter's situation. Uh, I'm torn up. You know, obviously we'd like to be there with her to support her and make sure everything goes smoothly for her. You know, I want her to be safe. I, I don't want her to just be sent over someplace else and forgotten about. Perhaps the saddest thing about this is that reaching the Olympics has been a lifelong goal for Kara Aker. I've had that dream since I, w I first came here. I was like 10 years ago. And So Kara Aker's dream comes to a halt today, and Leanne Wong has been put in, in an isolation situation due to quarantine rules because of contact tracing. However, her dad says that so far, Leanne has passed all of the COVID tests that they've had. The kids here are rooting for them. They have been around them in the gym for weeks and weeks and years and years. They've watched them. They want to follow in their footsteps. Trust me, it is a disappointing day here in Blue Springs. Reporting live at Gage Gymnastics Center, Neil Jones, KCTV 5 Sports. Yeah, Neil, we're all rooting for them. It is a bummer of a deal that they're getting. Thanks, Neil.